Awards. The Student of the Year Award 2020 goes to Hafsa Ali. Well done, Hafsa. Hafsa Muhammad Ali, or Akbar Somalia, or Kamida, Ardella Wakabra, Tawadin KUK, and Yakami Lote Sarat Khan, Ardella and Tahanat Kilakare, Karim Hasaraka Gale. Wahana Hafsa, a school kid, the Kagish Karim to Kuwat, Tasi, or Muchin, Sadelka, I submit say. Wahana Malamito, I saw in Umahad Alien, the Velki Bera, a Hafsa is so good shape. Hafsa has contributed in many ways to Capital Six and to Capital City as a whole. She studies English language, psychology, and philosophy and ethics. She herself has taken part in the University of Cambridge uh, Law Residential Programme and also got a placement at one of the top law firms in the UK, Brightside, Allen and Overy. Alongside her study, she was part of the Toe by Toe programme, helping our younger students improve their reading and always volunteered on many occasions to help at events for Capital Six or Capital as a whole. Hafsa ayaa ka hadashay dadaalkan ay soo gashay iyo waxyaabaha sababay in kaalinta koowaad ay ka gasho iskuulkeeda. Assalamu alaykum. My name is Hafsa Ali. I'm 18 years old. Inshallah, I'll be going to university in September. Firstly, I want to say alhamdulillah because hoy abo fifi ani i awiyan wallahi. Marka yara especially homework o abi laawin jire anything out of hana wo iti jire. Um, maths, English, science, what kind of So, first of all, I want to say thank you very much because, wallahi, I couldn't, I wouldn't be here without their guidance, without their help, without their instruction um, and advice. Um, but for the last two years, I've been mainly Jogan, Jogan, Kenya, with my little brother. So, Hoya, the last two years, very, very helpful, wallahi. Um, she was very understanding, especially because year 13 is a very, very stressful year. She was always listening to me, always giving me advice, always giving me motivation. So, alhamdulillah. First and foremost, I just want to say thank you very much for my parents. So, what have I been doing in my free time? In my free time, I have been volunteering with this charity organization called Connect Stars. Um, yeah, um, especially during lockdown and corona, we can't really go outside, so everything has been online. So I've been taking part in their online Zoom workshops for young children. And wallahi, it has been amazing. Do you know, watching the children grow, develop their skills, you know, become more confident, because on the first day, they're just shy, they don't really want to talk. But by the third day, they've broken out of their shell and they're really confident and, you know, it's amazing to watch. It's something that I 100% will recommend. If you have time, give back to your local community. Um, you know, give put your time and effort um, elsewhere um, to help other people because not only does it look good on your CV, um, so it could help you flourish personally. Um, it's just it feels good to help um, your local community and you know just feel as though you're rooted in where you live. Um, my advice to the Somali youth would be to work hard and to dream big. Don't let anyone um, hold you back, um, especially since our parents have had such a long journey to get here. They put so much time and effort into us in making sure that we achieve um, our goals. I would say take advantage of all the opportunities that we have, all the resources, because wallahi, they're just not available back home. So make their journey worthwhile. Um, I would also say try and surround yourself with people that want the best for you, that want to see you succeed, that want to see you flourish. Um, and inshallah, if you stay motivated, which I know is difficult at times, but if you keep the bigger picture in mind and you work a little bit towards that every day, um, inshallah, you'll reach whatever goal you are trying to work towards and you'll make your parents proud and their journey worthwhile. Um, but yeah, just keep pushing, keep working hard, keep grinding, and inshallah, it will all work out in the end. Muhammad Abdul Salat, London.